The Lord of the Rings Book 3 Chapter 1 The Departure of Boromir Ladies and gentlemen, fellow enthusiasts of epic tales and great adventures, gather around as we delve into one of the most pivotal moments in J.R.R. Tolkien's magnum opus, The Lord of the Rings. Today, we explore Book 3, Chapter 1, The Departure of Boromir. This chapter is not just a continuation of the story, it is a testament to resilience, the spirit of adventure, and the pursuit of a greater cause. Imagine the scene, the Fellowship of the Ring, having faced peril and wonder together, now stands on the brink of a new and daunting journey. They have formed bonds that seem unbreakable, yet at the foot of Amenhen, their unity faces the ultimate test. The weight of the ring and the shadow of Sauron loom large, threatening to tear apart the very fabric of their alliance. As the members of the Fellowship disembark on the western shore of the river, a sense of foreboding fills the air. Boromir, once steadfast and noble, is consumed by his desire to save his beloved Gundor and confronts Frodo in a moment of desperate confrontation. This clash is a powerful reminder that even the noblest hearts can be swayed by the allure of power. Boromir's internal struggle and subsequent actions highlight the complexity of human nature and the perpetual battle between good and evil within us all. Faced with Boromir's despair, Frodo makes a heart-wrenching decision. He chooses to bear the burden of the ring alone, a testament to his immense courage and selflessness. This decision, though isolating him physically, symbolizes the ultimate sacrifice for the greater good. Frodo's solitary journey becomes a beacon of hope, illuminating the path for all who choose to stand against darkness, no matter how insurmountable it may seem. As Frodo sets off alone, Sam's unwavering loyalty shines through. Despite the dangers, Sam insists on following his master, embodying the essence of true friendship and devotion. Sam's determination to stay by Frodo's side, no matter what, sends a powerful message about unity and support in the face of adversity. Meanwhile, Aragorn, Legolas, and Gimli face their own trials. They must grapple with the immediate threat of the Uruk Hai while coming to terms with the fracturing of their fellowship. Their resolve to continue fighting, despite their division, underscores the importance of perseverance and the enduring nature of true courage. In the midst of this turmoil, we witness the transformation of each member of the fellowship. Aragorn steps into his role as a leader, not by title but through action and integrity. His choices reflect the burden of leadership and the balance between responsibility and personal desire. Legolas and Gimli, despite their historically antagonistic races, find common ground and mutual respect, showcasing the strength found in diversity and unity. This chapter also brings nature's silent yet profound presence to the forefront. Amenhen, the Hill of Seeing, stands as a silent witness to this drama. The natural world, with its beauty and danger, mirrors the inner landscapes of our characters. The environment itself becomes a character, shaping and reflecting the journey of the fellowship. The departure of Boromir is a narrative rich with lessons. It teaches us that true strength lies not in the absence of fear, but in the will to face and overcome it. It shows us that the bonds of friendship and common purpose can transcend physical separation. This chapter is a call to action, urging us to embrace our own journeys with the courage and resilience exemplified by Frodo and his companions. In our lives, we too will face moments of breaking and remaking. We will encounter challenges that test our resolve and push us to our limits. But it is in these moments that we discover our true selves. Like Frodo, we may feel the weight of burdens upon us, but with courage and determination, we can rise above them. Like Sam, we can be the steadfast support for those we care about, reminding them that they are never truly alone. So let us draw inspiration from the journey of the Fellowship. Let us face our own trials, knowing that we have the strength to overcome them. 
Let us remember that even in the darkest times, there is always hope. The breaking of the fellowship is not an end, but a new beginning, a testament to the enduring power of friendship, courage, and the relentless pursuit of a brighter future. Thank you.